Anything can happen when you're in the hospital. Sudden bleeds, intolerable pain, and even uncontrollable vital signs. There are patients at the Cleveland Clinic with these problems and more. But as News Channel 5's Alicia Ciccoloni tells us, they aren't real people, but they are there to help save you. They blink, cry, sweat, breathe, and yell for help. I can't breathe. My chest. These simulated patients at the Cleveland Clinic are a teaching tool that are designed to save your life. Dr. Eric Jelosik says it's all done by using groups of medical professionals who learn to work together on these sim patients. A study showing that actually training on these simulators um, translates to improve patient care uh, as far as speed. Process, knowledge. So the team creates a medical situation and can manipulate each sim patient through this control room and computers to make the situation as serious as they want, helping even the most experienced medical staff learn a real life situation, whether it's in a hospital room or the OR. Here's an example of a mom who noticed her son suddenly stop breathing. Betty, talk to me. What's wrong? Betty? Mom, what's going on? Baby? Um, I don't know. Something happened to the shoe, buddy. Hey, Chris, what's going on? Oh, she's uh, unresponsive right now. I'm looking for a tacky on the monitor. All right. So, Does he have pulse? He does have Doctor. pulse. Keep doing CPR. John, can you handle the defibrillator for me, please, sure. here? Got the pads on him. Are you ventilating okay? Dial him up to uh, 50. Are, are we on the defibrillator? Doesn't look like we're on the defibrillator. Keep doing CPR. He has an IV running right now, and he's probably going to get lots of meds, and we're going to move him to the ICU, okay? The sim boy was stabilized, but it took that team working that fast to make it happen. That, that type of training together, uh, which is, has, has been missed, is now improving morbidity and mortality. It provides the best patient care possible. Alicia Ciccoloni, News Channel 5. We have more about the simulated patients on our website, newsnet5.com, where you can watch a full demonstration. Now let's check in with Leon Leon to see what's coming up tonight at 6.